Hello and welcome to another Photoshop Elements tutorial. In this tutorial we will be covering how to do light leaks to sort of emulate the toy camera effect. Okay. First things first, we're going to start with a photo. It's always a good place to start. We're going to bring up our gradient tool. We're going to pick a gradient and we're going to do the uh, fade to foreground to transparent. There we go. We're going to pick a sort of an orangey color. Kind of nice orange color. I like that. Okay. And then what you want to do is you want to pick a um, gradient scheme here. Linear gradient works well for this. Oh, that's backwards. Let's undo that. We're going to unclick reverse. There we go. Linear gradient works well for this. Um, round gradient also works well for this. But you don't really want to put it in the center like this. So let's undo this. The other thing that you want to do is you don't want to put it on top of the layer because, well, that just looks like that, and that looks like you literally just applied a filter over the top. So, undo that and create a new layer. This way we can change the blending mode of our gradient over here. So let's do that. And let's change this to soft light. As you can see, the effect is sort of faint. It's not very intense, but that's okay. So we can duplicate the layer, sort of increase the intensity of this, and change the effect of this. The other thing we can do is we can also change this and um, change this to white. Create a new layer. Do the same thing over this. Change blend mode also to soft light. And we can sort of just stack this up here and sort of blow out the side layer. There we go. Okay. Let's um, merge these layers. There we go. That's that, and let's let's do um. Let's go back to our orange color, and let's try some other gradients here. The linear one also works, as you can do like both sides here. Change that to soft light. We played that a couple times because we're on top of a white thing, so it's not really doing too much. And we'll create a new layer. Change this to white. To sort of emulate the totally blown out sections of this. Put that too softly. There we go. The idea is to alter the color scheme in addition to making it lighter. And you can keep on doing this, multiplying, creating layers and so far. Go back to round ones to do this map. But that basically sums up the tutorial right there. And with that, thanks for watching. Good luck.